Craniofacial Disorientation, or SD as we abbreviate it, is the leading aeromedical causal factor in Class A mishap. What the Kraken will bring, again, is in a controlled environment, we'll be able to replicate those forces of flight that get normal, healthy pilots into trouble. The accelerations of flight can actually lead to a pilot feeling like the aircraft is doing something that it's not. Once we throw that motion component in there, they're actually feeling that seat of the pants feeling of flying their airplane, and, and it could completely change the way we're looking at the vestibular illusion versus the, the visual illusion and putting those two together. SD is a killer, and we're trying to understand it better in our lab here at Namra Dayton. There's almost no vehicle that we couldn't simulate with this machine between the out-the-window displays and uh, reconfigurable controls and seats. We're able to take physics data from a flight simulator, things like, like the G-forces, acceleration, pitch roll, and yaw, and then convert them mathematically into uh, the, the actual motion limitations that the, the, the Kraken itself has. I think with the capabilities of the Kraken, we have, for the first time in decades really, an opportunity to address these problems because we can reproduce them now. It is a tremendous honor to be part of that as an aerospace physiologist and it really is a, a, the pinnacle of my career to be here and be involved with the development of this tool that will hopefully save lives and reduce the number of mishaps we have from pilot space disorientation. The, the team consists of the motion algorithm programmers. Uh, we, we have a series of physicists and mo motion experts that are coming up with math that doesn't even exist right now to convert the forces of flight into similar forces within the range of motion that the device allows. blessed to have a great team and, and that's the reason why this device is going to be a success is, is not because it was delivered with all the capability we need to do the research. This team is going to take it to that point. So together uh, with our next door neighbors here at Wright Pat, uh, we will comprise the single greatest acceleration research facility within the DOD and indeed within the nation.